All right, I tell you what here. This is how you change out a rod bearing the right way. Um, this is recommended by Ford. Oh, don't want to get it on oil anywhere. This is it's pretty bad. All right, you just gotta, just gotta take these old fucking rod bolts off. Yep, that's pretty good. Get this on. Oh no, I'm gonna start losing the oil here. That's all right. Okay, got them loosened up. Make sure your hands are clean, okay? You need ha clean hands. This is a very vital part of your uh, motor vehicle. Okay. Oh yeah, coming right off. Cool, and then set these in a clean spot, like the driveway. All right, now, to get off the, uh, the bottom cap, what you need to do is you need the handy dandy hammer and you just hit these threaded bolts right here hit them up oh yep there you go yep got it so looking at this uh it looks pretty good it's not too bad oh no that's not the bearing that's just the cap all right let's get the bearing off here let's push this rod up you know out of the way Ooh, mighty compression Okay, all right. Oh, well, I might have an issue here. There's nothing that I can't fix. The right, there we go. And my, oh my, use a clean rag. Clean, see? I should clean that out. Yeah, you know, It's just minor wear and tear on that bearing. That's it. That's all that is. Still looks pretty gosh darn good. If I were me, I would reuse it, but I already have another one. I'll just put it in anyway. But make sure you keep this area clean because you don't want to get no dirt, sand, nothing in the way. Oh, man. Compression. All right. Let's get this out of here. Get the upper. Yeah, there we go. That one's not too bad. You know, I might say so myself. It's pretty gosh darn good. And then uh, grab another, another clean rag, kind of just shake it out. Good to go. And then wipe down that journal. Oh, yeah. Make sure you hit those rod bolts on the journal, too, because that really helps keep some oil galleries in the fucking journal. All right. Ooh, let's go up a little bit. For, oh yeah, just scratch that. Yeah, perfect. And I'll just slide that fucker on there. That looks pretty good. See, now what you do after that is you get some brake cleaner and you just spray the fuck out of it. Spray the fuck out of it. Ugh. Make sure you get all the metal chunks out of there too. looks pretty good now what you do is you grab your new bearing Alright, sorry about that. I had to put my new bearing in on the, the lower cap. And when you put it in, what you want to listen for is the grittiness. Um, you really want the grittiness in there. It uh, it helps. Just, just trust me. Now, what you got to do... You gotta find that fucking piston rod. 
Yep, there she is. Uh, that looks all right up there. We're just gonna line that. Oh well, let's let's pull it down here. Holy compression! Ah, dang. All right, well, I can't really pull it down too far. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try and guess. Get that fucker in here. Make sure you rub it on every damn thing in here if you really can't reach it. Oh, fuck. I'm drop it, do whatever. All right, come on down here. Get down here, you son of a... All right, there she blows. All right, I got her a little dirty. So what you do is grab another clean rag off the driveway and you just kind of wipe it down. Yep, then just wipe it down just like that. What you do is you line that up right there. And two hands are best if you can reach, but if you can't, just kind of just kind of put it in. There we go. Oh, well, that's not quite. Eh. There we go. Whoa. Ah. Not quite how I want it. There we go. I heard the grittiness, and that's what you want to listen for. You want to listen for the grittiness, okay? So now, you shove this bad boy back up in there. Come on. getting there not quite there so you hear it hit that journal that means you're not cleared yet you could force it but I'm gonna do a little bit more before I force it because I really I, I can't afford to mess this motor up oh shit that was the journal come on baby yep there we go there's the clearance and what you do is just pull it down make sure you kind of wipe it down grab grab that clean rag off that driveway what you do is you just kind of wipe that journal down uh, yeah oh ooh. come on yeah that looks good enough to me then you just pull it down just like that and bam clearanced ready to go and then what you do is you kind of try and remember how you pulled this apart um oh yeah i get that cement off there maybe i could spray it a little all right now what you want to do I don't think it matters which way they go. Maybe it does. I don't know. But we're just going to put it there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Just let it sit right there. And then grab these, these rod nuts that you set uh, on the driveway. Kind of wipe them down. And then just twist it out. Then you grab the other one, find it. Oh, yep, yep. Oh, clean rag. Remember, clean rag. Okay. All right. And that one's got grittiness to it, and that means it's good. It's going to hold. It's kind of like thread lock, but natural. And then grab your handy dandy Ford Torque wrench, and you just tighten it up. Go, you know, he's got to uh, alternate here. Yeah, now we make contact. So go to Ford, uh, Ford uh, Torque Specs, which is right about there. And keep going. Go to another Ford Torque Spec, right about there. And that my friends is how you change out rod bearing the correct way <laughs> 